Welcome back. RCTC is about eight games into the season. It's about time we catch up with them. Jerome Cunningham, he said the Yellow Jacket season has not been up to their standards. Currently, RCTC is three and five with six games left on the schedule. However, those losses have all been in close games. The biggest loss by eight points and the last outing against Riverland, RCTC fell by four. It's in those losses that Cunningham and RCTC are finding hope to turn it around. It's kind of good to see that we're neck and neck with a lot of teams when we really don't feel like we've played our best. We have, we've had like a lot of turnovers, 15 plus turnover halves, and really I don't think we can say that we played our best game against one opponent and we lost. So I think I'm really excited to see us at our full, full potential. So let's see how they did, or excuse me, how they're going to do RCTC taking on Minnesota West tomorrow at 3 p.m. Again, hoping to turn that season around. Thanks, Julian. This week's KTTC Play of the Week goes out to Spring Grove's Caden Grindy for his two big dunks tonight against Southland. Grindy has been having a good senior year this year for the Lions. Spring Grove's win over Southland improves the Lions to 12 and 2 on the year. Also snapped the Rebels' eight-game win streak. We're going to see both dunks here one more time. But Southland, our Spring Grove, what a big win for them going up against the. Uh, Southland only had one loss coming into this game, so uh, thank you to Mr. Grindy for this week's KTTC Play of the Week. But Julian, we have a nice little play uh, coming up here that you saw. Yes, went out to PEM and got to see this play here as Luke Stevens gets it out in transition after the steal and 15. You gotta make the business decision. I respect <laughs> you, but come on, you got in that man's poster. We'll see it again. Stevens getting up high, slamming it down hard. Just all over the man. Heard they sold that poster in homeroom this morning. Just they did, Great yeah. <laughs> play as Stevens gets up high, slams it down. PEM had a couple of uh, alley-oops in their last highlight about a, uh, about a week ago. Yeah, PEM, they play a fun brand of basketball. They're a good team to watch when they're on. But uh, for Julian, I'm Mark. For the rest of the team, thanks for watching. We'll see you guys again next week.